the Salk Institute is cultivating the next generation of scientists through a competitive summer program. Just 13 local high school students out of more than 500 applicants were selected to work alongside world-renowned researchers. In this Innovate 8 report, Abby Black shows us how these young minds are sprouting new research to tackle climate change. Here at the Salk Institute, their high school summer internship program is giving local students real hands-on science experience. Like Kelly Seppner, she's studying how plants and fungi communicate, research that can make farming more sustainable. These are plants that are being colonized by the fungi. These may just look like plants, but they're helping to cultivate the next generation of scientists at the Salk Institute's biology lab. Plants are a really interesting model system especially since there's so much about the climate that we don't know and things in the environment that we can leverage to improve our agriculture. Kelly Seppner graduated from High Tech High Mesa and will study biology at UC Santa Barbara this fall. It's very important to make sure that science is understandable to people. She's one of just 13 students accepted from 521 applicants into the prestigious Heidoff Brody program, where students work alongside Salk scientists like Dr. Lena Mueller. They're working on real projects. They're mentored on a day-to-day -day basis by a scientist in my labs. Dr. Mueller studies how plant roots communicate with beneficial soil microbes, research that could help farmers reduce their dependence on synthetic fertilizers, which account for up to 5% of global greenhouse gas emissions. If we could use them efficiently in, in our fields, could really be a great alternative for fertilizers. Um, so we could potentially reduce the environmental impacts. And this is where they exchange the nutrients. Really, it's very cool to see what you do in the lab. It can lead to bigger changes outside and truly globally. During the eight week paid internship, students learn more than lab techniques. They discover how to think like scientists, ask research questions and present findings. Kelly will present her research when the program concludes this week. It's definitely been a challenge that I've worked my best to rise up to, uh, to present my research. These connections through STEAM are brilliant minds in cutting-edge science. Salk is such a welcoming community. It makes me feel confident in that as I continue to learn and grow, um, there is a place in science that I can find for myself, which is very inspiring. For Innovate 8, Abby Black, CBS 8.